Hi, welcome to the first Minor Minors video tutorial. This video is for parents and kids who are new to Minor Minors. To start with, we presume the parents will have already installed the Minor Minors app. If not, please go to the Apple App Store to download it. We're sorry that at this stage it's only available in iOS. Spell the name Minor Minors. There you go. Install the app. When you first click in the app, you will see this page choose I am a parent and you have to first register either through Facebook or email. We will choose to register with email this time. Once you have filled the details, we will send a notification code to your email. Please go to your email account to locate that email and copy and paste the one-time code back to the app to verify your email. Once this step is done, we can start to create our first child account. The first detail we have to fill in is your child's full name. Please do provide a name that can be verified with an identification record. This actually is a safety measure to protect our children. If we encountered any suspicious character, we will approach the parent and request to check with the identification record. If the parent failed to submit the record or the records, do not match with the details, we will delete the relevant account. But we can assure you that your child's full name will only be visible to our admin as your child will be required to create a minor name when they activate their account. So that's only the minor name that is public. Afterwards, you will have to fill in other generic details like gender, date of birth, also your current location, your native language, where well, you can feel more than one as long as they're really your native languages. For languages to learn, you can pick for your child whatever languages they're learning or they want to learn, as many as you can. For the demonstration here, we will pick Putonghua and German. And your child can change this setting whenever they want. After you filled in all these details, we will be brought to a page where you can choose to stay on the as a free account to enjoy the basic features or to pay a one-off $1 US or $8 Hong Kong to enjoy the additional features in the circle of trust, including group chat and private chat. But for now, we will try the free account first. And here you see your child account has been created. Now you can uh, create another child account where you start all over again or you press done to see your child's profile here. Now we will go through the steps on how to activate your child's account. If your child has her own phone or iPad, then they can just download the same app and start. Or if you are sharing the phone or iPad with them, then you have to first log out yourself. So you get in there. Let's say if they're sharing with you, then you have to go into the account settings and log out. When your child first click in the app, now they have to choose the role. Of course, they will choose I am a minor, part which is the lower part when they get in they will be required to fill in the parents email address if the parents have not set up an account for them beforehand the child will be reminded to do so first now they have to fill in the email that the parents have registered their account with once they've done that they should find a name on the list here if a parent have registered multiple accounts for their children, then they, there will be more than one name. But for our demonstration, we have only created the test accounts, so you just press it in. For here, the password is not asking you to create a password, but we have actually sent a password to the parent's email whenever they created any child account. So the child should ask the parent to check the email where you can see we have sent the parent a new email with the titled new password for the child's account where you can just copy and paste the password and there you go to the this page where you can really set up your own password and now this is the page where the child can set their minor name and this is the one the one name that will go public they can choose whatever they like the only thing is once this is set they cannot change their minor name and we will do birdie okay for the profile picture 
By default, it is just a minor bird. The child can personalize it by pressing the little red button next to the minor bird, where they can take a photo or choose photo from the photo library. Here you go. They can further decorate it by using stickers, like we will choose a pink bow, or even use magic pen to choose different colors to doodle on it, draw on it, or write on it. All right. This is pretty much it. Press done. Then the profile will be completed. The next page will bring us to the home page of the app, where each time the kids will go in and see this page. In the following videos, we are going to demonstrate how to navigate in the app for both parents and children. We will see you then. Thank you.